I am on a cheaper off-peak tariff for six hours every night, can deploying a home battery storage system without a full PV system make financial sense in January 2023? Let's find out. Hello YouTube, it's Sarab and welcome to my channel. I have been contemplating getting a full PV system with battery storage. However, due to the location of my house, particularly having tall protected trees around it, end up creating shade on the roof. Hence, we decided to only go for the battery storage system. And the day has arrived when all the materials are being delivered on a very large lorry. So here is a very quick installation time-lapse video. Also, for your information, the setup I'm going for is all give energy. That is this uh, 9.5 kilowatt hour Gen 2 battery. Uh, I've got a three kilowatt hour inverter and of course the give energy dongle which is going with it and at the same time um, um, i've chosen to go for a double socket at the same time in case there's a power cut and um, i would be able to draw power from the battery so here you can see uh, we started first thing in the morning raman uh, was was here at around eight o'clock and it took him around uh, the whole day to finish the installation so between eight and five we were done, installed, commissioned, and ready to go. So we've just finished commissioning a Give Energy system uh, with a Gen 2 9.5 kilowatt hour battery. Uh, this is an AC coupled system uh, with a 3 kilowatt inverter on the G98. Uh, so, you know, it's, it's, it's powerful enough to charge this battery within a decent amount of time. And also uh, we've got an EPS, uh, which is a double socket and it gives you power uh, via normal uh, grid uh, supply and also uh, via the battery in case of a grid failure. So this is pretty much like a finished product. We need to stick a couple of labels on. As I mentioned, this is an AC coupled system, uh, which means it's a battery only option which is going to charge and discharge the battery uh, via this AC inverter. Uh, in this particular house, uh, they're really tall trees uh, with a lot of shading. So the customer, it's not really viable to have solar panels installed. So it's only going to be the battery option on its own, uh, which he will use to charge at a cheap night rate, at a cheap tariff. Uh, I believe he's an octop uh, octopus uh, uh, with Octopus Energy and the rate are about 10 to 12p per kilowatt hour. So it's a very good option to have. So we're just going to uh, do a demonstration on the EPS uh, backup power. So this is the current voltage. It usually varies about uh, 2390, 240. Uh, and we're going to now turn the power off to the whole property and watch that socket remaining live via this uh, nine and a half kilowatt battery. So I've just uh, turned the whole power off to the house. And as you can see, the power went off, and within seconds uh, it came back on. So now there's literally no power to the property. Uh, we've turned all the power off but you can see the socket remains live. So now we're going to do an earth loop impedance test just to, to see how good our air fraud uh, connection is. So I'm going to put that on a three wire no trip uh, and press test and you're going to see our reading is 1.18 which isn't too bad. Thanks, Ramin, for taking time out to walk us through the setup you've done for us. Um, so here, what you see on your screen now is how the mobile app looks. The interface is very slick. And this was another reason why I decided to go for Give Energy, is the data you get is endless. You can do as much analysis as you want. Within the app, you have got so many tabs, so much information, what you need on your fingertips. However, it does not end there. 
then you move on to Energy Cloud. So give Energy Cloud, which is the desktop app. And the moment you go there, you get even more data, more detailed, different tiles. You can customize it. You can add, delete the way you want it. So it's not like one size fits all. Right, so this is all from me today. But before I sign off, I'd like to thank Ramin from Electech who helped me install this system. He project managed the, um, the whole process right from ordering the materials, having them delivered and coming and installing it, even though during the busy Christmas times. So thank you so much, Ramin. Uh, I will leave Ramin's details uh, in the comments below. Please feel free to drop any questions you may have and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Once again, thank you so much for watching. And if you found this video informative, please do not forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. It's Zorab signing off.